there's a lot of tactics he used to try to manipulate me. And it's kind of like this, like once you learn and identify all the tactics of manipulation and like narcissist and shit, it's a pattern. You could see it like clear as day. And so here's what he said. I just didn't understand back then that what I was doing was hurting you. You didn't understand when I was crying on the floor and telling you, please, can we talk? And you just left me there that you were hurting me. <laughs> You're fucking 47. I think you can understand. Also, like, it was a communication issue. We just needed to learn to communicate. No, take a fucking step back right there because I'm very fucking self-aware and I work on my shit. And I tried every which what fucking angle to communicate with you. So I know on my part, that's clear. Any type of miscommunication things that you're trying to say was purposely done on your part. Don't fucking lie. Another thing was like, Oh, I didn't understand back then. My ex, his his baby mama was manipulating me to to think these things about you and blah, blah. I'm like, I don't give a fuck what you fucking trying to misplace blame on the fucking woman that you're trying to be in a relationship with now. Like, that's your fucking thing, you know? It's not, it has nothing to do with her. It has everything to do with your choices and everything you did. Don't try to shift blame, you stinky bitch. And then another thing was like, he started another, the newest like approach that he said was, I've been working on myself, and I've had time to learn and reflect, and I really know now, Shay, that it was whatever the fuck bullshit words, you know? And I'm just like, so how long were you studying and planning at your house, scheming, trying to come up with the newest way to try to manipulate me? Because you know that's what I like, people that work on themselves. But the difference is, is like, you don't actually do it. You're just saying words. You just literally... <clears throat> Bow shit, bow shit, bow shit. So like, you could say that you work on yourself as much as you want, but like, proof is in the pudding. You're not doing shit except for going home and trying to figure out the newest way to try to manipulate your way back in, you know? And it's like, all these dumb snaky tactics like that he was doing to try to like get me to like want to be with him again. And it's like, how, how sad is that? Like, imagine if you spent that time genuinely working on yourself and taking accountability and saying sorry, we could have fucking been together. But no, that's not who you are. Or no, that's not who he was. He's just a fucking snake ass bitch that just like tries to use every fucking way to sneak his way back in. Like, I just don't get that. I just can't. Somebody freaking say some prayers for this guy. Anyways. Take care.